everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be unboxing the Lavish Bath Box for November 2018. Lavish is a bath subscription that sends around six, seven-ish um, indie bath products every month. It is $38.95 um, plus $6.99 shipping within the US, or at least to me here in Virginia, which is about $46. I pay, I think, in a six, six month increment, so it comes down significantly. It's either $41 or $43 doing it that way per month. Um, so this month's theme, well, I think it's Dreamland or something like that. Let's see, so when you open it up, it is packed by love with Carrie. And then you have the card, which the theme is Dreamland, and then all of the goodies inside. And it smells like lavender and like a spa. It smells very peaceful and serene. So I always love the art that they have on their cards. It looks like we are getting a total of six products on the back. Um, and let's go ahead and get started. I'm really excited. Um, if you're into unboxing videos, go ahead and subscribe to me. I do lots of different unboxing videos. If you're into bath subscriptions, I have a, another bath subscription. I have beauty subscriptions, home decor, food, all different types of boxes. So, um, the first thing that I am pulling out is by Nerdy Not Dirty, and this is, oops, let me if I can get it out. This is the Goodnight Star Bath Bomb. Um... Drift off to dreamland with this beautiful star-shaped bath bomb scented in the twilight dupe of lavender, ylang-ylang, and tonka bean. Apparently the star style may vary. Oh wow. That really, that smells like sweet lavender. Oh, this is gonna be, this is great if you're gonna take a bath like right before you go to bed and you want to be able to sleep. Wow, I really, really love the scent of that. And the next thing I'm pulling out is by Soak and Unwind. And this is their Sweet Dreams Whipped Scrub, a luxurious whipped sugar scrub scented in fresh cucumber and sage and infused with natural chamomile, lavender, and cedarwood essential oils. And this is a lavish exclusive. So that's kind of, it is a blue, like a, well, it's like a, a blue purple and a pink purple. <laughs> oh my goodness. That definitely smells like cucumber. This box definitely smells like a spa. It is going to be really fun to use these products. I love getting these um, sugar scrubs. They're great in the shower if you just want to use them as a body wash to exfoliate. They're also great if you're going to... I like to shave my legs in the bath because I can get a closer shave. I don't, I don't know if that's TMI or whatever, but these are great to do before you shave to kind of loosen up the follicles. So excited about that. The next thing I'm pulling out is by Soaring Suds, and this is their Honey Lavender Bubble Bar. Break into pieces and crumble under the tap for the dreamiest bubbles scented in soft rose petals and lavender with a touch of honey and vanilla. That smells good. I like that. You can definitely smell the honey and the um, um, vanilla and a little bit of those rose petals and lavender as well. I like that. I'm sorry if you can hear people talking and or yelling outside my window. I live in the city, so it's a little bit unavoidable. I can't really control what goes on outside of my window. Um, then from Mama Bass Shops, oh, sorry, Mama Bath Soap, apparently I cannot read. Um, we have the Dream Machine Fizzy Bath Milk. This coconut milk fizzy bath powder is scented in a blend of lavender, baby shampoo, vanilla, and cotton candy with cracked pepper, eucalyptus, and spearmint topped with glittering purple chunky sea salts. I don't want to go ahead and open it because I have a lot of bath stuff, but I do see the salts at the top of the package, and I'm sure that it will smell amazing. I can kind of smell it a little bit, and it does smell really, really good. So very excited to use that. The next thing I'm pulling out is from the Spinster Sisters, and this is the Soy Lotion Massage Candle. The sweet oatmeal milk and honey scented candle does triple duty as a lotion, a massage, wait, as a lotion and a massage oil. To use, blow out the flame and gently rub the hydrating jojoba oil and shea and cocoa butter oils onto your skin. So let me open this up so I can sniff it. If there's a little perforation here. And of course I just cut my nails the other day so they're short. I actually ordered one of uh, like a, a Marrakesh or so. I, I, I ordered one of these in a, as a FabFitFun add-on. I'm still waiting for it to get here, but um, the whole idea of this type of candle sounds amazing. Oh wow, yes. It's just a white candle, regular wick, but it definitely smells the milk and honey and oatmeal. I love that smell. 
it smells like, and I don't mean this in a bad way, it smells like the really nice, like, public restroom soap. Like, the stuff that you get excited to have. Not the stuff that smells weird, but this smells really, really good. This will be fun to, to massage or hydrate with. And it's good, like, I feel like wax to, like, moisturize your legs or other body parts is great during the winter. During the summer, I think that would be a little bit heavy, but during the winter, I think this would be great. And then the last item I am pulling out of the box is by Naturally Vain, and this is their Sleepy Shower Steamer. Place tab on the shower floor away from direct stream of water to release relaxing lavender essential oils into the steam for a true aromatherapy experience, topped with real lavender buds, and it is a lavish exclusive. Oh, wow, that smells really a lot like lavender. Oh, I'm so excited to use this. I do, I think I have, a, I have one shower steamer that I saved from my March lavish box. Is that right? I have a shower steamer saved because I love shower steamers. Um, like, if you're sick, it's like, if you have a cold, it's like the best thing in the world to get in a hot shower with one of these. Now, because this one has flower buds on it, I would recommend putting it in one of those little, um, like, just like a little bag. What are they called? I'm not sure. I, I have I have a couple of them that I've gotten in, in bath boxes before, but that way the petals stay inside the bag and that they don't, they don't fizz everywhere else. Um, super excited about that. I really am loving all the different contents in this box, and there's a good variety because you get a bath bomb, a, so a whipped soap, a bubble bar, a bath milk, a candle, a steamer, so it's not there's not like a duplicate type of item, which to me is fine. I don't care if it's all bath bombs, um, but I think it was a really great box this month. Let me know um, down below what you thought of this box. If you're into, if you want to subscribe to the Lavish Box, I will leave their information down below to make it easy for you. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, and I hope to see you in my next video.